guys and thanks for stopping by my channel. I'm having a bad hair day. I'm having an interesting makeup day because I just did a makeup challenge and we're here to open some friend mail that I have been waiting to open. Um, so let's get to it. The first piece of friend mail I received is from Marion, AKA Life Unboxed. If you don't know who she is, she's a very lovely lady. I'll link her channel down below. Literally, you guys, she just got married to her online YouTube friend. Can you believe that? Love can happen anywhere and it can happen on YouTube. So congratulations, Marianne and Nate. I hope you all the best. Enjoy your journey together. But she sent me this. She said it's not something big. She just saw it and thought of me. I'm assuming it's Halloween or horror related. Um, we're gonna go ahead and open it. It was very nice of you to do, Marion. Thank you so much. Oh, okay, cool. So this is History. It's a magazine, and it's the Haunted History. I actually saw this, I think, in a checkout line somewhere. That's so funny because I was showing my husband, and he was like, I don't want to look at that. Oh, my gosh. This thing retails for $14 and $17 in Canadian money. Oh, I am so... I'm going to be honest. I'm going to read this in the bathroom because this is bathroom reading material for me. So thank you so much. This will be very interesting to read. Look, it even mentions the state that I live in. How cool. So this just talks about Salem Witch Spirits, Amity House Horror, um, Amityville Horror House, Ghosts of Gettysburg, The Specters of Yellowstone. So this will be a very interesting um read look at this the dybbuk box remember we opened something similar to that on my channel wow this i can't first of all you spent way too much money honey but thank you so much i'm definitely gonna read this and i'm sure i will learn things because i don't murder houses i'm not really big into like serial killers and stuff i'm more into like um the supernatural stuff but it does dive into like the charlie the charles charlie like i know him charles manson and that kind of thing so that's interesting um what's her name shannon tate is that her name poor woman that was a sharon tate the one that was like an actress and she was pregnant like who killed i don't get it but it is interesting to say the least so thank you so much marion i appreciate you okay Next, I have to talk about this in this video. I know what this is. This was sent to me by Kimmy's Boxes. Kimmy, well, Kim, thank you. She was very happy when I sent her friend mail and I said, all I want is the one chip challenge because I saw that she did it. She did it. She took a little tiny crumb, okay? We don't do that here. We're very much go big or go home in my mind, so. Thank you so much, Kim. I know this was not cheap. Actually, when I asked for it, I only thought it was like $6 because I never really looked it up or anything, but it was actually a lot more money than that. So thank you so much. But this is the Pocky One Chip Challenge and it is made from Carolina Reaper peppers, which are the hottest peppers in the world. I'm gonna go over that more when I do the video. And what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a live video of this. I will post it on my community tab when I'm going to be doing this live. I have already read how to survive the challenge, how to protect your stomach lining and stuff like that. So I'm going to be smart about it, but I'm definitely going to try it. I actually do not handle hot spicy food well at all. So there might be a follow up vlog of like how I'm slowly dying. I don't know, but I'm super excited to try this and also terrified, but I asked for it. And I got it. So thank you so much, Kim. I appreciate that. Marion told me she was sending me something. Kim told me she was sending me something. But I got something from Random Reviews with Stephanie and I had no idea she was sending me something. So this was a complete shock. Where are my scissors though? Like, honestly, where do they, where do they go? Hold on. Oh, they're, they're right in my eyesight. Okay. 
she sent me a boxy. Well, can't really show. Um, she said, well, she sent me a boxy charm box. I have no idea what's in this. Random reviews with Stephanie. Um, my heart goes out to you, girl. I don't want to like have to bring it up, but she is taking a little break from YouTube right now. She usually posts on a regular basis. She's a really sweetheart. We've done a collab together. I'll link her channel down below as well, as well as Kimmy, Kimmy's boxes. Um, but Stephanie, her dog got hit by a car and watching her video, like, literally made me tear up because if you know anything about me i'm a dog person i love dogs they're my kids and i'm a mess whenever my dogs pass away so my heart goes out to you i'm so very very sorry he was a beautiful dog and he is now with my dogs up in heaven that's what i want to believe and they're happy and they're pain-free and they're just waiting for us at this point you know so anyways but she sent me something and I don't know what it is. Or, oh, okay. Okay, hold on one second. I just dropped a bunch of candy on Titus because he's at my feet right here. So she sent me a whole bunch of Halloween candy. So thank you for that. This is what I'm seeing. It has my name on it. And it's really, it's, there's a bear. Appreciate that. There's an ongoing thing about bears because I used to have a bunch of them in my yard. This is a cute little card. It says, let it snow and it has my name on it. What did you have? Why did you send me this? Like just for fun? <laughs> just for sh shits and giggles? <laughs> oh, here's another card and it has a little fox on it. Cute. And it says, okay, Tiffany, I thought I would send you a couple of goodies. I am so glad we have met. You are a great person and you make me laugh. I just love your channel. Keep on keeping on Joe Dirt, LOL, your friend, Stephanie. Oh my God, that was so sweet. Thank you so much, Stephanie. You didn't have to. That was like, that's so nice. When people think of you, it isn't even like what it is that they send. It's just like the gesture, the fact that you are occupying someone else's mind. Okay, so let's see, what is it? Other than candy, which is always appreciated. Not needed, <laughs> but appreciated. And it's buffalo plaid, look at that. No more Walmart bags, ha ha ha. What? What are the, oh, for my hair? You... <laughs> I was like, what do you mean Walmart? I use Walmart bags for everything, clearly. Not for my hair, not anymore. She bought me a bag full of hair, like, caps. Oh my God, that is hilarious. Was, did you get this from Wish or Shein or something? This is so great, because I have to do my hair again. And when I do, I'm reaching for this. So thank you, see? Like, that is just so thoughtful, because she always sees my videos where I have a Walmart bag on my head when I'm dyeing my hair. <laughs> okay. And then, oh my God, like I don't even deserve this. She says, Tiffany, I'm, I handmade this box for you. I hope you like it and the gift inside your friend, Stephanie. Friends are hard to keep, but easy. Wait, friends are hard to find, but easy to keep. You made this box? Oh my God. Like you're so crafty. Like if you don't know her, she's an artist. She paints, apparently she makes boxes. Look at this, this is like a journey. Tiffany. Happy holidays. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. This is a box. This is Tiffany. Happy holidays. Merry, Merry Christmas. Ho, ho, ho. Oh my God. So it's a box and there's like rubber bands inside. Wow. Okay. This one says, keep join your heart <laughs> snowman because I didn't know. I didn't know that was a snowman. So thank you for pointing that out. Deck the halls, not me. I don't deck my halls either. Keep joy in your heart. Oh, that's so cute. Wait, what's that say? A star is born. I don't deck my halls. What do you mean by deck? you don't deck your halls? You mean you don't, you don't decorate? Cause I don't decorate. But it looks like you might. <gasps> There's so much confetti in here. <laughs> There's confetti everywhere. Joy to all, old St. Nick, tis the season, be jolly. How do you make these boxes? There's like a there's like a rubber band system going on in there and then it's just like a box. 
Interesting. And then the confetti nightmare that I always do to other people. <laughs> friends forever, hee hee. We are friends forever. Oh, that is so sweet. Look at that. I think she just sent this so she could send me a bunch of confetti, to be honest with you. Um, <laughs> uh, Christmas cookies, Santa Claus, Christmas party, Christmas music. You know, it's not December, right? It's still only November. Don't rush it. It'll come. <laughs> At the bottom of the box with all the confetti, it says, Christmas is coming, and yes, I am that girl. Well, yeah, you must be, because it's only like, what, November 7th or something? I don't even know. Yeah, it has to be. It's been seven days since I quit smoking, so it's the 7th. You are that girl. You are talented, and you made a mess in my spare room, so thanks. I appreciate it. <laughs> it's nothing I wouldn't do. I've done it to people many, many times. And then, oh, I seen her unbox this, and I was like, that is so cute. This is um, a wolf, I don't know if it's an applique or a sticker, but it's a wolf howling. Is it a sticker? Because I could just plop that right on the wall. One size, well, let's open it and see. I don't know, but we're gonna find a home for this guy along with all my other wolf-related things. So that is my friend mail video, you guys. What do you think? I want to say a big thank you to Marion from Life Unboxed, Kim from Kimmy's Boxes. Oh my God, I'm losing my mind. And Stephanie from Random Reviews with Stephanie. I will link all of their channels down below. Check them out. They're all lovely people. They're all caring. They're all thoughtful, obviously. And I will see you guys in the next one, okay? Bye.